I know I've lost a lot of followers, but I can get them back. I just need a chance to redeem myself. That's all. Sweetie, I am your biggest supporter. No one has more faith in you than I do. But until you turn things around, don't talk to me. The Kardashians have been in the show business since the early 2000s. Riding the controversial fame that many people call fake fame, the Kardashians managed to control it by starting their own family reality show called Keeping Up With The Kardashians in 2007. The show became a hit with soap and drama-loving people and shot the Kardashian family across the Hollywood Heights. Hey guys, we are your source for every latest drama that happens in the industry. In this video today, we bring you more hot gossip from Hollywood. This time, it's about the two former BFFs, Kourtney Kardashian and Addison Rae. So stay tuned with us till the end and make sure you hit the subscribe button for more updates. The sisters in the family have had many best friends over the years, but only few of them have lasted. The rest of them got wrapped up in controversies and then had to cut ties with the family. Particularly, the Kourtney Kardashian has had many best friends in the past. Emily Wojcicki and the model have been close for a long time. Then we have Harry Hudson, Chrissy Teigen, Luca Sabat, Stephanie Shepard, and more. According to reports, her latest BFF was the TikTok star Addison Rae. They became best friends in early 2020, but ended their friendship recently. What exactly happened between the two? Why did Kourtney end their friendship? Kourtney Kardashian, who appears in their family reality show, is also a founder of Poosh. The website is a lifestyle blog. Along with this, she's also created pregnancies with Kim and Chloe. Addison Rae, the 21-year-old, has been making TikTok videos since 2019. Recently, with a video, her TikTok account blew up and now she has a massive following of over 81 million. She released her song Obsessed and made a debut in the music industry. These celebrities are poles apart. Then how did they meet and develop a friendship? All this happened due to Mason Disick, the son of Courtney, and her ex-husband Scott Disick. Mason had been a fan of Addison since January 2020 when he joined TikTok. Then how did the 10-year-old kid get in touch with the social media star? It happened due to David Dobrik, a YouTuber, who had made a cameo in Mason's previous videos. David was the one who introduced Mason and Addison. Then the influencer went over to Courtney's house where she shot a dance video with Mason. In their next video, David also joined them. But Mason's fame on TikTok did not last for long. Unintentionally, he started spilling the beans on his family's secrets. Of course, his mother Courtney had to intervene. It resulted in Mason's account getting deleted from the social media platform. Due to Mason, the two of them got introduced. Then Courtney posted a video with Addison on her YouTube channel. They made a virtual workout from their homes. While talking to each other, they found a similar interest, skydiving. Both decided to go on this adventure together. Then in June 2020, the former best friends started making TikTok videos together. In one of the videos, they made a spoof of keeping up with the Kardashians. They posted selfies together, wore matching clothes, and went on outings. One of their pictures in which the two were lounging in Courtney's pool stirred up a lot of controversies. Fans started commenting how their age difference was looking weird, strange, and confusing. One of the fans commented that this woman is 42 years old, yet she's hanging out with girls who are 20 years old in a pool. Courtney had enough of this and gave a savage reply saying, you can also recommend me new places. It proved the model did not care what the world thought about them. Courtney shut the fans down, but her family was still a bit worried about their relationship. Kim had asked her sister's son where did Addison sleep when she came over for sleepovers. To which Mason innocently replied, she sleeps with his mother in the same room. This sparked controversies. The news headlines were asking one thing. Were Courtney and Addison hooking up with each other? During one of the episodes of Keeping Up with the Kardashians, Kim invited Addison to clear up the air. Kim said that her sister was too happy with Ray. She has never seen her like this. According to Kim, her sister got so obsessed with the influencer that she almost stopped hanging out with her sisters. So during this awkward lunch, Kim threw the question towards Addison. If she was hooking up with Courtney. The sister had no problem if they did, she just wants to know the truth. Scott, her ex-husband, also said someone finally addressed the elephant in the room. He was keen on getting an answer. Addison cleared up the confusion, saying it is strange people are thinking like this. But nothing like this is happening between them. After this, there is visibly uncomfortable laughter among them. There is no surprise that Courtney also did a cameo in Addison's first Netflix movie, She's All That. Fans knew due to their age difference, their friendship would not stay strong. Then in an interview, Addison was asked if she felt Scott and Courtney will stay together forever. Ray replied with a stern no. She could have easily dodged the question by saying no comment. There were alleged reports that Courtney and Addison fought over this. Of course, the reality star is bound to feel upset. The rift grew more when Courtney started dating Travis Barker. When her boyfriend became friends with Machine Gun Kelly, she came close to Megan Fox. 
the minute the internet saw the pictures of Courtney and Megan, they were quick to assume that she had replaced Addison. They did a hot photo shoot together wearing Kim Kardashian's underlined skims. Their hot and sexy pictures broke the internet. Fans could not stop praising the two beautiful women. The friendship of Courtney and Megan became strong because of their partners. Travis and Machine Gun Kelly are making music together at one studio. The two are jamming to new tunes every day. Fans knew that this behavior of Courtney would have broken Ray's heart. Once this happened, a lot of fans started noticing a weird pattern of Addison's behavior. Once she got approval of the Kardashian clan, she started spending a lot of time with them. According to fans, this was the reason for the transformation or behavior. First, she tried to copy Kim and Kylie, who already had their beauty brands. She also started her beauty line called Item Beauty. Their products hit the market and her brand became quite successful. Next, her dressing style also changed. She observed what Courtney and her sisters were wearing. Accordingly, she started wearing the same kind of clothes. If this was not enough, Ray wore a replica of Courtney's red dress she wore on Christmas 2019. When the cameras captured the pictures, the social media star was wearing this, and fans were stunned by her desperate behavior. One of them said she should go and take Courtney's wardrobe. In one of the videos the influencer also mentioned, she wants to start a reality show with her parents. You can see the clear resemblance here. After this, Addison started switching boyfriends as Courtney has done before. With their latest boyfriend Jared, fans think they're just another copy of Courtney and Travis. Amidst all of this, Addison's birthday just went by and reports claimed that Courtney had sent her a cake. What is happening between the two? We caught the pictures on Instagram on one of Courtney's fan accounts. The cake was a copy of the look Addison had in 2003 at the Met Gala event. This was the sweetest gesture by the Pooch founder. Addison tagged her best friend saying thank you for the cake, and the star replied wishing you joy for the upcoming year. Due to the wavering nature of the two, fans are now thinking the worst. Whether this was a PR stunt to attract attention. Reports claim that this PR stunt was an alleged idea of Kris Jenner. Ray's PR team reportedly said yes to this plan. It would mean that the social media star would constantly be in the news. If rumors are to be believed, Addison's PR team went to the lengths of tipping the media. This way, wherever she went, the paparazzi would do constant coverage of the influencer. The two ladies came together to promote their brands. The boom they got was when they made a lot of videos and posts for their social media accounts. All these PR strategies helped Addison to get a lot of fame and followers. I mean, every person associated with the Kardashians has gained something one way or the other. There are also reports that Kim disliked Addison a lot. She was noticing her behavioral pattern from the start. In one of the episodes of Keeping Up with the Kardashians, she warned Courtney's kids to stay away from such people. She never directly mentioned Ray's name. All these reasons might have opened Courtney's eyes, and she must have decided to take a step back from the friendship. The fans are still wondering if any of this was real or a fake drama created. Well, until we hear something from Courtney, or Addison officially, we won't be able to say anything. Till that time, do let us know what you think about the two and the drama surrounding them in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more hot gossip about your favorite celebrities. See you in the next one.